Hey guys, it's Lee, and I'm back today with another Dollar Tree haul for you. I am going to show you all the items I found, and then after I show those to you, I have pictures of items that I didn't need, but I thought you might like to see. So let's get started, and this is going to be in no particular order. I am just going to be grabbing stuff out of bags. So first up, I found this Body Organics Tropical Scented Body Wash. I don't know if Body Organics is a real brand or not. It's manufactured in Canada. I don't know. All I know is that it smells really nice. So I bought three of them. Next, I grabbed two more bags of these <laughs> crispy hello and they are three ounces and they're a product of Mexico so my husband really likes putting these on his salads but I also came up with an idea to use them on chicken I will make that video it might take me a couple of weeks but I will make that video and put it up for you he really liked it he said it tasted so good I don't need jalapenos so what I did for me I used the crispy onions because I'm not a fan of spicy so it's really good and <laughs> I'm dropping everything on the floor but I will make the recipe and show you guys what I did next up I found this Gildan performance tearaway shirt in a size large let's see if you can really see the actual colors it's green and gray kind of mixed together um, yeah I really like it fabric is a little weird for me but someone in the house will like to wear it. They had them in purple as well but not a good size for anybody in my family. I grabbed a few more packs of these Foppers dog treats. It says gourmet pet bakery cheese flavor bones and these are made in the United States. So I got cheese and then I got two in peanut butter. I have found that the Chihuahuas, who really don't like treats at all, except for their greenies, will eat these once in a while. I think they only eat them so the Greyhound can't, but they still will eat them. It's rare, probably a half of one per week. They don't eat a lot of them, but it's nice to have something else to offer them. Next up, I found these balls by Squash, I guess, or is that the name brand? Yeah, we're going to go with that. It says you can smush them. They're so jiggly and you can toss them. I ended up getting a pink one and a blue sparkly one. I also picked up these two pens that I thought were pretty cool. Inside they have um, star glitter in both of them. So I got a purple one and a blue one. I love stuff like that. So last time, I think it was the last video, I found the paper clips that go with this. These are Adore Sticky Notes, and they are by Design Group. I went ahead and got two of these. They're page markers, really. And then I found magnetic bookmarks, which I got one for me, one for my daughter. I was thinking about using, the, using these in my planner to, you know, just show which page I'm on if I have to flip back and forth. I thought those were kind of neat. I guess I should show them to you a little more closely. You get four of them. And I just think they're adorable. I got two more of the crispy onions. These were from a different store. Let's see if they'll sit up there nicely. And I did not need this. But look how pretty this composition book is, so I had to get it. It's pink and has strawberries and flowers all over it. I had to buy it. And I will use it for something. I'm always scribbling down notes for my YouTube channel or just lists of things I need to do that day. Then I rip the page out and, you know, I go through it a, a lot. I tried using my phone to keep lists on and I just don't like it. I like to write my lists down. In my last haul, I said that I regretted not getting the little dinosaur backpacks. So I went back, and they only had the dinosaur ones left. Uh, that was the, that's the storm in York, Pennsylvania. 
and it's the store on 30. I only saw the dinosaur. They're just so cute. So I picked up two of these. And what I said in my last video is that I'm saving these for gifts for kids, you know, for gift bags. Or if you know someone who has a baby and they have an older child, um, you fill these with like coloring books and crayons and little things for the older child so that they have a nice little gift too. I picked up two of these mason jar mugs and the reason I got them is, do you remember, I should have gotten three actually, a little while back I found the lids with straws that go on mason jars uh, to make them, you know, to turn them into a drinking cup. But I like these with the handles so I got two, yet there are three lids in that pack. I'm not sure what I was thinking. Um, anyway, I'll get another one I guess at some point. It's not that big a deal. But yeah, I thought these would go, go really well with those lids. Next I got this bag. It made me think of my daughter. It's just a reusable bag that has a B on it and it says B positive. And if she doesn't want to take it to Ireland with her, I'll just save it with the rest of the bags we have till she gets home. I am going to be covering up a shelf and I wasn't just I couldn't decide which one of these I wanted so I bought this quick cover by contact in this like brown speckly I guess stone pattern and oops <laughs> and then I also got it in a marble pattern I'm not sure which one I want the other one I'll just use in drawer drawers but um, yeah, so I picked up both of those to have options. I don't know where to put it. And then I got this vinyl top liner to put in drawers. So I picked up two in marble. And these are 12 by 30 inches. So I got two of those. And then I also picked up three of these Main Street Wall Creation wallpapers. Spiel, a spiel, peel and stick removal, re, words, man. Removable, fashionable. Anyway, I got three of these. They're a little crumpled from being in the bag and then I just threw them in my car. I wasn't that careful with them. So I'm sure they'll be fine and I can straighten them out. So I got three of those. Next, I got these cute little dog decor pieces. I think he's so cute. They came in white and black. It's adorable. I'm going to put them over here. And they also had cats. So I got this one in black and in white. And I got this one in, well, white. And black. I thought they were so pretty. They also had elephants, which I took pictures of. I didn't buy the elephants. But I just thought those were adorable, so I grabbed those. So here is the other backpack that I didn't get. I got the avocado, the peach one, two of the dinosaur, and now a rainbow one. This was at a different store, and it was the only one they had, and I can't, can't even remember which store that was, but... I got that. And then I picked up the matching little pencil cases. Yes, they're calling them pencil cases for the backpacks. Those are adorable. This did not come in the dinosaur design, but I was able to find the little tins, the little hinged tins in the dinosaur, dinosaur design, so I got two of those. I picked up three of these storage containers. I love that they have the locking lids. These are these come in handy for so many things. So I got one in green, one in pink, and a clear one. I found a little spiral notebook that matches the cute little backpack, so I thought I could put that in there. I didn't see, although I didn't look that hard, honestly. 
ones that match the other backpacks, but I did get one dinosaur and I really should have gotten two now that I think about it, but it's okay. I picked this up for my daughter, All You Need Is Love, and a cat. Look how cute that little decor piece is. Um, again, if she doesn't want to take it to Ireland, she can leave it here till she comes back. I picked up another one of these little stationery sets. It has a B on it, and it comes with a list pad. Um, I think one of these, I don't know if they're all list pads or if there are sticky notes in there, but it also comes with a pen. And these are really cute to put in gifts for people, so that's why I buy them. Plus, I use them myself. So then the last item I got for this haul was this home pumpkin sign. I just thought it was really pretty, and it's the only fall item I bought. I did find a few items, and I took pictures of them, but I don't need them. And I'll say that now, and in future hauls, you'll see some of that stuff because it, you know, it's so cute. And I end up with so many of these signs, but then I can rotate them through the season, right? That's what I tell myself, but I never do it. Hold on. I thought that was the last item, but I also did pick up this little notebook with an owl on it. It's just a plain little notebook, and it has 60 sheets. Now, that is everything I picked up this time around at the York, Pennsylvania Dollar Trees. I think I went to every one of them except the one down in Shrewsbury because gas prices are crazy, and that's about 30 minutes from where I live. Now I have some pictures of items I saw in the store, didn't need but thought you might like to see them so check those out and meet me right back here.
welcome back. I hope you enjoyed those pictures and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the little bell so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. You can also find me over on Instagram, Pinterest, and Facebook at Lee's Home 05. Thanks for watching. Bye. Thank you.